It's that time again for Switchback. Switcher Studio moves fast, so we're here to round up updates, app improvements, product releases, and company news. So let's dive in to Fall Switchback 2022. November was a busy month for Switcher Studio. We kicked off a score of new updates with Switcher Studio 8.5. This update brought a new scoreboard, horizontal inline, and customization options to all of our scoreboard templates. You can now add background images and team logos to display with team names, and we've added an optional sponsor image slot to promote your broadcast sponsor or just yourself. 8.5 also brought two new graphic options, animated text and timers. Animated text lets you add scrolling text to the bottom of your screen that can either behave as a ticker or bounce from side to side. With timers, you can create an overlay or full screen timer for any minute and second value between 0 and 59.59 and add a progress bar for a visual on how much time is left. Both timers and animated text are fully customizable for size and color. We can't wait to see how our sports users take advantage of this big new update. November also brought enhancements to the Switcher Player, as well as a new Switcher Player feature, Playlists. Viewers can access your most recent live streams or other video you upload to the Switcher Player, letting you create a video content library on your own website. The Switcher Player itself also has a new look. When you embed the Switcher Player on your website, a viewer can hover over your video and click into interactive mode. They'll be greeted with a pop-out menu where information about your video and any links you want to include will appear. And if you're using the Switcher Player to sell products during a live stream, an additional tab will appear for viewers to shop and check out. At the bottom of the Switcher Player, viewers are able to peruse your playlist of recent live streams and videos, as well as click to the next or previous video. How would you use the Switcher Player on your website? Let us know in the comments. After rolling out Carter this past summer, we listened and implemented lots of feedback from our early adopters, and that led to a new Switcher Studio pricing plan, Merchant. With the Merchant Plan, you get everything that comes with the Studio and Business Plans, but with the addition of Carter and its live selling capabilities. You're able to sell live on Facebook with comment selling, or use the Switcher Player to create shoppable video. You can learn more about the Merchant Plan at switcherstudio.com slash pricing, or reach out to our sales team directly at sales at switcherstudio.com. The app updates kept rolling in December with Switcher Studio 8.6. This update brought ease of use improvements to the Switcher Studio app, including batch imports and display duration options. You can now import multiple assets to the Switcher Studio app at once, cutting down on front end time and smoothing out the pre-production process. Additionally, assets like photos and graphics can now be set to display for a certain amount of time, and assets like videos, timers, and animated text can be assigned to dismiss automatically once they're finished playing. 8.6 also brought timestamps, which lets you add markers to your live Switcher Studio production and access them when making clips, allowing you to quickly find those rewatchable moments and repurpose them for more video content. These app improvements allow for faster work on the front end, more focused live editing, and efficient repurposing of your video content. Let us know which new feature is your favorite. That's it for Fall Switchback 2022. For more on everything we mentioned, visit switcherstudio.com. See you in the next one, and until then, thanks for watching. Happy holidays and happy streaming.